Capital, mostly capital, capital, capital is indeed a great problem to our youth and the, the saving culture. Men don't know how to conduct the business, mm. so they need to be at least taught on what to do or guided. Mm. So we lack some skills mm. and maybe not only skills, mm. but we also need some support, yeah, like advice from the elders and those who, ask, who have some experience in a particular field of business. So if at least we, be, we receive all that, indeed, we shall be well and we shall be okay. In Uganda, 45% of the respondents are primarily self-employed compared to 15% in Ghana. Another 5% in Uganda are working on their own business while also studying, while 12% are doing it in Ghana. <laughs> Sister Although not having good qualifications and not being able to find a wage job are the main reasons for being self-employed in both countries, there exist big differences. In Uganda, 28% of the respondents gave positive reasons for being self-employed, such as higher income, flexibility, independence or interest, compared to only 6% in Ghana, where being self-employed is also often required by the family. I don't know how to do it. Because, no, no, queen. Oh, queen. 
and Magadum, Magan, a yeasum, or one way in the Sabuku. Because Sabuku was our dara because an unnet to my dinner at last at that moment. Go on a mamma, mamma, by in Bajaz Lava Payana. There are huge differences between both countries. Although many youth in Ghana believe it is easier to earn a living by being self-employed, most of them would prefer to have stable employment. In Uganda, a vast majority of the youth would prefer to remain self-employed. I basically started that business with only cement, around 20 bags. But right now I have around 50. From the idea I had to get a friend of mine who who linked me out to this cement supplier in this area of ours. So I went there, I contacted him, gave me the feedback. At first he disappointed me because he told me 20 bags I cannot, you cannot start another way with 20 bags. But because I wanted to go ahead with the business, I had to push on, push on. The biggest disadvantage of my job, sometimes it is season. During rainy season, construction work is minimal. For the season, I always put in some little money. It was quite difficult, but because I liked what I wanted to do, it came easy. It has not reached where I want it to, to be, but at least I am the, I'm on, I'm on the way.